Hey, alright guys, Trif Quigley here today, and we're back with Evan Galley on episode 8. I just want to say thank you for all the comments that were left last episode, I enjoyed reading them, and I like to see people's different opinions on that last episode. It looks like the, com the community as a whole on Evan Galley on, I'm guessing, for last episode, you either like it or you don't like it. Something like someone explained to me, it comes across as filler. By the way, thanks for the long, long comment explaining what people think of it. But I like the whole like political side of it and interesting, and I also like how shady it shows nervous and just gives us more insight in the company and how the world works. I can see it's filler stuff, but I can see why some people might think it's one of the worst episodes. Like someone says uh, in the comments, that I have to differ. Like he thought it was the worst episode, and I thought it was like one of the better episodes. But that's just I guess it's just to do with how you take things and what you enjoy. And also I'd like to apologise to. Uh, anyone I might have spoiled in the last episode on Guru Log On. I did edit it out around 50 views, but anyone who was one of those people before the 50 views, if, um, if you watched till the end of the video, I said it's Guru Log On spoiler, so I do apologise. I probably, if I am going to talk about spoilers again to compare shows, I'll make sure I do a spoiler warning. I didn't even think or remember, so I edited out with a YouTube trimming tool, so it should be gone now. But yeah, I like I liked that first episode. I love the fact that showing how shady there was. I liked how we learned about the world, um, what all the countries are like take all the credit themselves where they just have all the money so yeah so make me come to like with nerve like i didn't think nerve were all goody two shoes but it's nice to know like now we've got confirmation that they are shady oh yeah please like and subscribe if you haven't already and make sure you check out my other series I'm doing death parade jojo's and even and i'm doing all the season anime along with that so please check those out as well I'm surprised they don't separate a bit more, knowing that angels could just blow up a whole area straight away. Oh, we finally meet the other girl from the intro. Finally. I want to see what this one person's like. Why did she bring kids along? It's just embarrassing. <laughs> Savage. Check her hair moving in the wind. The animation. Ask her. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> of course, there's a panty shop. Why are you wearing a skirt in this weather? <laughs> what a savage. <laughs> what did you expect you was going to get? Why did you do that? So this one's drives an Eva as well. So we've got three Eva drivers now, aren't we? We're just going to see them like, all work together at one point. That'd be cool. He does look kind of goat dull. Who's this swab guy? Is this an ex? <coughs> that looks like an ex. Why are they kicking each other under the table? For fuck's sake. Totally went out. They totally dated. Why is the new girl mad? Yes, I knew it. No, he's just British. <laughs> How did you fucking get up there? I would you want to know. I actually got up there in heels. No, it's laying on the floor, we can't really see it. That looks pretty sick to be fair though. I still think the purple one's the best. She's gonna try and pilot the Eve on, isn't she? Is it Asuka? I think that's how it's pronounced, Asuka. Yeah, I'll Google it later, just because I'm dumb dumb. It's hard, you know when you're listening to Japanese subs, it's very hard for them to catch the names because they just say so fluidly. What are they doing? Are oh, we gonna get like an under we Oh, what oh, one? Oh. What do it looks like? I don't know just wrecking the boats. How many people died on the boats as well? You'll think there's fucking thousands of people on one boat. Yeah, I wonder how smart the angels are. Like, do they have spies and stuff like to get this intel? You. Yes, he is a perv. We all know Sinji's hid hidden agenda. He tries to deny it, but he always looks like he knew what was happening. I think he looks pretty swaggy, to be fair. Oh, I love that. That's so satisfying. <laughs> That's not how it works. You should ask. <laughs> Definitely got spunk.
What about chilled she is compared to the other two? One's like devoted as hell. Sinji's like always in a panic and she's just like fucking eager as hell. Oh, mate, she don't know if she's happy with her doing it. <laughs> she's so unprofessional sometimes. God damn it. She's got control over it already. This is the first time she's piloted it, which she piloted it a few times, I'm guessing. I think Sinji is the only one trained. Oh, that one looks sick, to be fair. I like the red. That's my second favourite either after the main one. I don't re I don't really like Reese either. It's not I don't know, just look I don't like the design of it that much. Oh, they would look sick, sick fine together. That like, colour coded though. I would say she's wasted so much money, but it's like it wouldn't really destroy it either way. Surely it's been 50 seconds. Alright, sweet. Hey. I was going to say, if they did that 50, I like the fact they got like an extra power spawn to fall for them. Oh, she got a sword! Is that a sword? Yee! That was really tiny, but still. Fucking hell, it's massive! Why did it flop onto the ship? We should have fought it in the water. If it was ready, the angel was not super. I would have put her in the water. Oh shit. Oh yeah, I will go in the water. Shit, I wonder how these things go. <laughs> Mate. She has passion, I like it. Shit, is that a city? Oh, that's a city that's been underwater. Wonder what happened? Is it like a tsunami happened? So it's Japan's, if this is Japan, I wonder, where, wonder, what, wonder where that is. Oh, we're actually going to use normal equipment. I love how destroying the Eevee's not just always as simply as brute force. I've got to come up with cool plans. I really do appreciate that about the show. It could just be so simple, like just slice it in half, but they've come up with some cool ideas for it. And it really shows me Sir is actually like pretty damn clever, which he wants to be. Why are you hitting him? No, oh, did he just take over controls? So Oh she's still sync with him, he's just controlled it. I wonder how, I want to know so much more about the angels. It's so annoying. I hope we learn some soon. This is basically Darling of the Fires. This is what they templated the whole show off. This one scene. Oh, that's a sick shot. Yes, perfect. Nailed the landing. I like how the badge just blamed last trailer. That was a sick scene. I like that. That was really cool. I guess the lucky didn't remove him off the boat. That's how it was open it, open, open the mouse. I like either that sort of like a power skin if they can use 100% of its power or not. What? Adam and Eve? What? <laughs> She's joining your school, mate. Ha, <laughs> wrecked.
I think that was a good way to introduce Asuka. She seems pretty neat. I like her. Miso carried the team again with the big battle plan. Um, no, I like that. I like that. I think the interactions with the two mate, two the girl character and uh, Sinji, is it Asuka and Sinji, was pretty neat. I love the new Evon, um, the new Evon unit. It looks pretty sick, to be fair. I think it's my second favorite looking one after the first one, after uh, Sinji's Evon. Yeah, pretty neat episode. Good way to introduce character. I like how like they had to come up with that cool plan. It wasn't just as simple as she slice it up. She had to, had to like to go dragged underwater we got to see a city underwater so i wonder what happened there like i'm guessing the tsunami happened or because like they didn't have that nerve at the time maybe this then was able to sink a sink a city i'm going to say the guy in charge um sinji's dad is a villain i'm not sure what his motives are i'm quite curious to see like is he actually just a good guy or is he just shady as fuck um yeah i don't know i think that was a cool way to introduce her if she seems neat um i don't, I don't I'm not too sure yet like, i need a few more episodes with her but i like her i like her spunkiness and like how different she is from the other three. Like they all three complement each other. Like Re Ray's really conserved and cold. She seems like she's got a lot of room to grow. Sinji's just like Marty, but he not lately. Like I like him lately, but um, obviously he's a lot more panicky. He um, gets stressed, very depressed. Obviously suffers from quite quite a lot, but overall he's been really good the last few episodes. Like this episode, he was actually quite decent. The episode before, he was um, bearable as well. Like I actually quite liked him in those two episodes. And she seems a lot more chirpy, spunky, and just like very eager to show off, which is, yeah, seems pretty cool. I don't know who I'm going to like the most out of the three. I think Asuka, I'm go probably out of the three of them, I think I'm going to like this. Just from this episode, I think I'm going to like Asuka a bit the most. Um, I'll try and get back to I'll try and sort out my name pronunciation next episode, so I do apologise, but yeah. I think like, from the at the moment, from the how they've all been introduced, I think I'm going to like her the most. But we will see at the end of the series who I'm going to like the most out of the main three there Miso is still my favourite character like, I love her she, I think she's great and yeah not too much to say about that episode I just really enjoyed it I thought the action was cool and like, I love how it was done and the actual arm we actually served the purpose in this episode so yeah um, hopefully you enjoy me next week um, as I will be uploading episode 9 and I hopefully you enjoyed the episode so please like comment what your thoughts are on the episode as I enjoy I do enjoy reading them when you leave them